Local church is holding a special ceremony to mem memorialize Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. on the 46th anniversary of his assassination. 27 First News reporter Miriam Hobbs shows us how they honor Dr. King. Lift every voice and sing was the first song you could hear coming from the Mahoney County Courthouse during a ceremony to remember Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Dr. King was shot to death on April 4, 1968 in Memphis, Tennessee. We're commemorating um, his memory, but realizing the dream um, that he wanted for this entire nation, but did not see that dream himself. Organizers believe celebrations to remember Dr. King should be going on across the country. His contribution to race relationships um, is, is the foundation for what many of us um, feel changed the um, the direction of this entire nation. The Reverend says King sacrificed and gave up so much, even his life, to see his dream realized. God had called him to lead a nation um, out of the bonds of, of discrimination and segregation, and uh, he undertook that task, and um, he did it with great sacrifice, and we're all blessed as a result of it. Dr. Martin Luther King, Jr. was a labor hero. Jalada Aslam says one way we can remember Dr. King is by participating in the political process. Dr. King and so many other people that were involved in the civil rights and human rights movement fought extremely hard for people of color, women to have the right to vote. She says we should also be making an effort every day to advance Dr. King's dream. And that's not just people of color. That is Americans of all walks of life. I mean, what Dr. King wanted was for equality for everyone. In Youngstown, I'm Miriam Hobbs for WKBN 27 First News.